daughter of the sacred Yahimi tree and Inanis' gift to Angiera. Leah sprung to life from the prayers of people that needed a savior. She was the last of four descendants and their only hope as the first Zurian civilization succumbed to internal violence and war. Leah never desired to use her powers for war, so she escaped into the jungle, hunted down by a fearsome warrior. Leah only survived with a burst of light and wind as colored feathers enveloped her in a timeless cocoon. Her civilization fell and thousands of years passed. When innocent hands graced the tree on the highest temple, the cocoon split open. Feathers poured out and danced around the figure it held. With the same dazzle of light and wind, Leah took to the skies and disappeared into Azuria she no longer knew. Leah, heir of the jungle, is a Sky Slayer class myth who is of the Disruptor and Diver archetypes. Leah's passive is Wisdom of Yahimi. Every so often, Leah gains an additional effect on her next basic ability cast. Her special ability is Tailwind. Upon activation, Leah gains massively increased bonus movement speed for a few seconds. During this time, she takes increased damage from all sources. Leah's first ability is Galebound Thrust. She stabs her trident forward, dealing magic damage to all enemies caught in the line. At the end of this range, gusts of wind slice out, dealing the same damage to enemies caught in a cone. Enemies cannot be damaged by both the thrust and the gust. Wisdom of Yahimi causes this spell to echo, striking in the same position again for reduced damage. The Air of the Jungle's second ability is Sacred Plumage. Leah releases a wave of magically enhanced plumage. Enemies caught in the cone take magical damage, and those in the center are also slowed down. Wisdom of Yahimi causes this spell to heal Leah and any allies within the effect radius. The heal increases per enemy hit. Leah's third ability is Graceful Glide, Crashing Dive. She leaps up into the air for a few seconds. While hovering, Leah can choose a location to crash down, dealing magic damage in a radius and knocking up all opponents. Wisdom of Yahimi increases her dive speed and gives her a shield that increases based on how many enemy myths she hits. Her ultimate is Windstorm. Leah launches forth a tornado, dealing magical damage and knocking up all enemies hit with the tornado. Upon reaching the max distance, the tornado will return to Leah, dealing magical damage and pulling all enemies towards Leah. She can recast to return the tornado early. When playing as Leah, it's important to have map awareness and seek to initiate any potential team fights. Disrupting fights is her specialty, as she can turn any skirmish around and drive her team to victory. Become a menace in the enemy team's backline as her passive ability effects can give her a massive survival edge. Beware of enemies that can run away from her claws, or tanks who can withstand her fury, because then, not even the skies will save you. Build enhanced shoes to conquer the map with your flight. To deal increased magic damage on your basic attacks, get Ring of Enchantment, or if you prefer to harass your enemies, get Cosmic Rod. Mark of the Elemental Predator is a great item to show who rules the jungle. If the enemy holds the upper hand, get Talisman of Life and heal back with every ability. To force your enemies to keep their distance, get Dragonheart's Jewel and engage them on your own terms. Play as Leah in Ethereal Clash of Souls, coming soon.